We're the Bourbon Junkies. Again, it is uh, the fourth day of Christmas. And my true love gave to me a oh. good way to rule my channel. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> because we guessed so wrong. Yeah, day three was uh, an atrocity. Day three is what I like to call a good old fashioned cluster. Look at this. Get day it, four. Getting it all off. Come on. Plot trap. Come on. Right? Ah, oh, yeah. Ooh. We'll just set, Dude, set that. Dude, this looks like a nice yeah. alien. Yeah, there you go. I have to keep that one like that. Day numero four. Okay. Let's try not to get this one that I was wrong. Oh, did we even introduce ourselves? Yeah, I said it. Oh. I don't know. I'm Dan. He's Sean. I don't know if I did that part, but I said the My bad. He's right. All right. Oh, I just got like. I don't a... don't say anything while I'm sniffing it. You say it's a rye, and get them like, yeah, this dude is probably Asian maple syrup barrels. I don't think it's a rye. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I don't think anything's a rye. <laughs> dude, it was so spicy. It was, the palate really convinced me. We're really gonna be hung yeah. up on day yeah, three. Yeah, we can't talk about day until three until we uh, our careers. <laughs> until uh, we come up onto a different I got day where we. Fired from my real job for it. <laughs> come up on another day that we just blow just so it. much, yeah. Ooh, smells pretty spicy. That apple like crazy. Yeah, hard. This this is so apple, but not in an artificial way. Like a crisp red apple for real. I know. I, I keep going in deeper to try to find another layer to it. Yeah, I feel But like it's super, super overwhelming. Apple and a little maraschino cherry on the old back of the nose there. I don't... I don't see any vanilla in this though, or anything like that. I get a little under undertone of cinnamon. I was hidden. thinking nutmeg. Because there's a, a hint of- Nope, you know what it is? It's you know what I'm getting caramel too, because it's with the apple. Because something's like complimenting the apple really well. It smells really nice, actually. There's a, yeah, there's a little something in there. Man, it smells like I cut a red apple, for real. Like you slice one up, put it on a plate. Really bright, my jeez. Mm -hmm. That's true. Smells a little bit delicate, honestly. Oh no. I'm looking forward to this one off the nose. Yeah. What? Nothing. It's not Clyde Mays. You think it's Clyde Mays? <laughs> no. No, you don't remember the nose. <laughs> yeah. you think this is Clyde <laughs> we taste a hundred whiskeys, you put Clyde Mays in front of me, I'll tell you off the nose. Light, caramel forward. Mm, it's okay. really light. It's really thin. Yeah. Light and thin, very delicate. Extremely delicate. I think it was really caramel forward. Um, I was expecting that like red fruit to just come bursting through and it just didn't show up. This, I think there's a little more proof than, than previous experiences. Than 40%. Maybe in the 100 range? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'd say in the 90s. 90s? Maybe high 80s. It's gotta be 90s. It, it's definitely got some uh, lingering burn and mm -hmm. it is not uh, spice it proof. And this is gonna be. I agree with the caramel Ford. This gonna is gonna be probably, 40, 40 proof. This is probably the most like um, I wouldn't say stereotypical bourbon because I don't think it is because it's really no. bright. It's really bright. And there's, there's not, not a lot of oak. Yeah, I was gonna say there's no like wood aspect to call it stereotypical. Maybe at the very end of the finish. Not a lot though. Um, the more I keep going back to it, like it almost goes apple saucy for me. Oh, that's interesting. Like I could, I, the more I'm smelling, the more I'm getting some cinnamon with the apple on the nose. Yeah, cinnamon applesauce. Cinnamon apples. It's not bad, man. This is this is a middle of the road whiskey for me. Yeah. So far, um, um this was like a forty dollar drinker. You think so? I, um, I think so. I don't think it, it's it's not bad, but it's not like blow your socks off. I know. I'm so I'm trying to I'm trying to equate I, it I don't to think we own this. I don't have a guess on this one. Um. Uh, the thing about it is, the nose, the more I drink it, the nose matches the palate, where it gets really bright and delicate, but there's this little, like, undertone spice, which I'm considering yeah. to be cinnamon. it sits there the whole time. And it's nice. Yeah. And it's nice, and it's an easy drinker. The proof seems a little bit higher than things we've had uh, the past few days. I think the red fruit is a little bit more, excuse me, um, like, of an undertone. Yeah. Okay. Oh, an undertone. More so to than the caramel. I think it's more okay. caramel forward on the palate. And the, no, so it's like apple or mm. you know red fruits kind of there. Caramel is there, and then the spice is just underlying the whole thing. Dude, you know what I get? I get a nice sweet oak on the palate now. I let it open up a little bit in my mouth. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? 
You can't, get, you can't rate this. And I get a nice sweet oath. You ready? Buy or not buy? Wow. Uh, I mean, that's going to be price dependent. Okay. What's your price? 40 ish? 40 ish. Yeah. Range? Give or take. Yeah. yeah. It's not bad. We've bought things around the 50, 60 worse than that. For sure. All right. Day three. No, let's move on. Uh, do you have any guesses, do you think? I don't think we own it. I think we own it, but I don't have any. I almost think it's like a mash bill, too. No way. You don't think so? No. There's no way that's mash bill, too. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Hey, do you want me to drop the mic and walk off? Like, kind of detach the mic, drop wow. it, and leave? Or Which what can I do now? Hublands oh. and the mashable dose, and I'm right, and you suck. You owe me a dollar, <laughs> and I got this right. Wow. Did I nail this? You just got so lucky. Did I nail it? Did I nail it? But, Woo! which, oh, probably not the store pick. We told him not to get that. Yeah. On the eighth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. Day I am right, you are wrong. Oh, no, that's, that's the store pick. You are wrong. Don't care. Still wins. Oh no, my god. This is not the store pick. Can you believe that I, just, I nailed it? Oof. Get that out of my way. That, uh, that really shocked me. Hold on just a second. If you guys are wondering, it's my end. You went to a mash bill to take one distillery? 93 proof. Oh my gosh, could I have nailed it more? I said, 90 some proof. I said, mash bill two. You said, no, it's not. You said, maybe more than 90 some proof. You did bring it back down. And then I said, oh, I never said more than 90 good stuff. Yeah, you did. I'll put it in. Replay. Then 40%. Maybe in the 100 range? Yeah. I'd say in the 90s. Oh, it feels good. I'm just basking. It's like the lights got warmer because I'm so happy right now. You know what I mean? No. I just smashed this one out of the park. You went, I went, Babe Ruth. I didn't even walk the bases, dude. I just dropped you the bat still and walked back the, in the You dugout. still gotta do that. Not me, dude. You're out. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys know what it's like. He called the last one terribly. I called this one spot on. <laughs> Uh, we're the Bourbon Junkies. I'm Dan. I'm Sean. And the proof is obviously in my palate. 